If you're not a long-term investor, if you want to get rich quick, stay away from this stock. This this stock is for the people that's looking to. I don't speak opinions, only facts come out of my mouth. I'm hustling in my veins. What's good, YouTube? Let's get this money. You already know we getting money. We eating honey. Y'all see the title of the video? We talking about Palantir stock, ticker symbol PLTR. This stock down over nine percent on the day, sitting at twenty four dollars and twenty five cent. Let's see why this stock down so much on the day. It's from the Motley Fool. This article came out today, and it say why Palantir stock is down today. Key points: Palantir reported earnings that match expectations on stronger than expected revenue, but the defense business once again led the way. Palantir has great tech, but its valuation is excessive for a defense IT company. Unless the company can quickly grow its commercial business, questions will remain about its valuation. Say what happened on Tuesday morning? They out there acting crazy. They say what happened on Tuesday morning, Palantir reported third quarter results that ranked right up there with the best this period among defense IT companies. But it also didn't offer much reason to believe that investors would need to view it as anything other than a defense IT company anytime soon. Shares of Palantir fell as much as 10% in the morning trading and wore off around 8.8% .8 at 12 p.m. So what now? Palantir best known as the company whose technology helped locate Osama bin Laden went public about a year ago and immediately shot higher as the market considered the potential commercial sector applications for its data analytics tools. Throughout its nearly two decade history, it has been mostly focused on government contracts, but those tend to be low margin contracts and investors this far has valued Palantir more like a commercial software vendor than a government focused one. So y'all see what they talking about in this article. They trying to say all oh, they got going on is they defense technology. And that's why the stock price pulled back with the earnings being neutral to earnings. You know, it wasn't crazy over the top and it wasn't that bad either. It wasn't too far under the expectations of what the analyst said. It say the company reported third quarter adjusted earnings at 0 0.04 per share on revenue of $392 million, matching expectations on earnings and beating the consistent sales forecast about $7 million. It has been a tough quarter on the government side of business with numerous contractors reporting revenue slowdowns, but Palantir business shows strong resilience. The issue though is Palantir remains a very defense focused business. Government contracts accounted for nearly 56% of those total sales and that segment is growing at nearly the same pace as its commercial business. If those trends continue, Palantir rem remain closely tied to the defense business for the foreseeable future. As such, it's going to be a hard press to deliver the growth rates that investors envisioned when it first went public. Now, y'all see what they talking about in this article, man. There's one article, but they been talk they they talking like that in multiple articles. But I just use the Molly Fool article as an example. But man, this stock right here, I still see long-term growth in this company. That's why I'm invested in it. I'm a long-term investor. I'm not worried about what this stock do in the next year. I just want it to double, triple for me in the next few years, five years. You know, I'm looking for future results, man. And I still believe this company will do that. And it's definitely going to get back past this $30 resistance in the next six months easily. Could even get there by the end of the year. But this stock right here, if you're not invested in this company and you plan on investing in it, if you're not a long-term investor, if you want to get rich quick, stay away from this stock. This this stock is for the people that's looking to invest in a quality company that's going to grow slowly over the long term. And I feel like Palantir is going to have its day, man. You just got to be patient. Y'all see? We we been we ran we ran up to the thirty around September. We got up to like twenty nine, almost thirty dollars in September. We but we got denied at this resistance. Now we starting to slide back down under twenty five dollars, and I believe this stock will probably fall back down to twenty three, 
might even file to $22 in the next few weeks. But after that, after it found the bottom, we got a strong support at $20. Don't believe we go get back down that low, but if we do, it might be another bad opportunity to buy some more shares to add to your position. If you believe in this company, you know, I don't know if I'm going to say this quote exact, but I know Warren Buffett said something like this. If you can't, if you can't hold a company for five, for five, 10 years, you should hold it for five to 10 seconds, man. Like that's how much faith you should have in the company that you're investing into. And Palantir, one of them companies, that I plan on holding for the long term. Not looking to get rich quick off of this company. And you shouldn't either. So you gotta be patient with this one. And with any stock, really, you gotta be patient when it come to this stock market. And yeah, this stock having a downfall right now, down 9% on the day, that's a big hit. But I'm not worried at all, and you shouldn't either. As long as you got in at a good price, long as you, hopefully you didn't buy when it was at $40 up here, but if you know how to read them charts and you know when to get in at a good price, man, you should be cool on this stock. Just got to be patient. It's going to bounce back. Like I said, we might have some more some more downfall. It might, it might go down some more in the short term, but it's going to bounce back in the long term. So just be patient with this stock. And, hey, stay tuned, man. I'm, I'm going to probably be going live tomorrow morning, market open. So stay tuned. If you ain't subscribed or if you will subscribe, Turn on them notifications because I'm going live tomorrow, market open. But yeah, man, if you like the video, hit the like button for me. Subscribe if you ain't did that yet. Comment what y'all think about Palantir. Comment what videos y'all want next, man. I got y'all. Let's get this money. I'm gone. One thing they gonna say about me is I get paid. One thing they gonna say about me is I ain't playing. One thing they gonna say about me, I never ran. I don't follow niggas. One thing that for sure, I set the trend.